I'll say that. Hey! Big legend! Big legend! Whoa! Dude, they must have increased pack odds. There's no way I'm getting all this sauce right now. Oh! 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 <laughs> what is going on? Pack and play squad A! It is Ben. It's been a while since the last insane episode. Oh my God. Literally the craziest episode of anything I've ever done. I can't believe that what I believe to be one of my favorite Madden videos on my channel was down the pack and play squad and not Wheel of Mud. So with all the Halloween packs, we have a ton of really good Halloween players. We have never used this D-Hop yet because we got it the last episode. We have never used Todd Gurley yet because we got it at the end of the last episode. We have some insane players. As soon as we make it to the playoffs, this team does reset. So honestly, I'm not looking for too much in these packs. This team is so good. Look at this, dude. So even if we don't pull anything crazy today, I'm okay with it. D-Hop, Sutton, Gurley, Stafford, Patrick Ricard, Henry Ruggs, and 87 overall. We got Kittle, Noah Fant. 87, 85, 85, 83, 87. That's really, really good. If I can be picky, I'd love a better strong safety, better free safety, because I use those so much. That would be very helpful. Impacts right now is a Roquan Smith, a Brandon Brooks, and then they just dropped the 50 Ed Reed. So the absolute best pull right now, aside from something like super crazy rare that's not supposed to be in packs right now, is that Ed Reed. So I get one bundle. I presume I'll do, I don't know. The elite bundles have been so good. I'm going to start out with a four times the 50 fantasy bundle. We'll see how it goes. If this goes poorly, I'm going to do the elite bundle. All right, let's see where we can go, boys. Chukwuma Okorafor. $100 if you can pronounce that properly. First try. None of these guys really, oh, power-ups. I love power-ups in this Zeke. Okay, I could actually be my backup halfback. I need a more creative way to use power-ups in this year. Series, though. I will say that. So if you got a good idea, let me know. Hey, big elite! This Bobby Wagner! <laughs> no, I got two <laughs> good elites! Ah! Oh my god! No, don't you dare be like a 93 overall, bro. Okay. Okay, wait, so I have to make a choice here. I did just get Todd Gurley, so I feel like Bobby Wagner is a pretty obvious choice, but I am sad. I would love Derrick Henry as my backup half. I was talking all about if these packs are bad, but I never talked about if these packs are amazing, and so far, they're really good. DeAndre Swift is gonna be a good pack. Maybe? Rod Woodson, no, that's not gonna help us too much. Steve Smith, and we need a 93 otherwise, this isn't gonna be a good pack. Dang. I guess I'm gonna take Rod Woodson. Hey, big elite to start this pack out, it's JJ Watt. Dude, did they increase pack odds? They must have increased back odds. There's no way I'm pulling all this in the second round. Emmanuel Sanders and 87 JJ Watt? Or maybe I'm just getting lucky. Michael Vick, we got a team of the week card right here. It's, ah, uh, no, this isn't such a great topper actually. And then 83 champ Bailey. This is the last fantasy pack here. All right, not much to worry about there. I, I wasn't expecting much. We do get a DJ Moore. A Dill pick. Oh my God, I skipped over the animation. Wait, I'm gonna back out, wait. I can go back. <laughs> I always forget I can go back to the animation. I can cheat. Ooh. Okay, ah, I did it again. I'm embarrassed. Let's pretend like I'm just now seeing it. There's the coins, I love this game. 88 Aaron Donald, and it's the quick sell edition, meaning, wait a second, I have the 87, right? Aaron Donald, JJ Watt, Bobby Wagner. At the start of Madden, this would've been the greatest pack opening of all time. I'll say that, hey, big legend, big legend. Whoa! Hey, let's go. Dude, they must have increased pack odds. There's no way I'm getting all this sauce right now. Ah, 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 no, 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 no. Dude, if you put another 91 right here, I'm gonna throw something through my TV. Okay. Uh, what do I choose? Okay, dude, my brain wants Jimmy Graham. Oh, uh, this comparison thing is so broken. Okay, so my best corner right now is Antonio Cromartie. Next best is Murphy Bunting. Prime time would be really good. Yeah, then my third best is Taylor Ramsey. And I have a lot of corners on the field. They always do this, bro. They always, you know what? I'm going 91 Jimmy Graham. This is the worst pick because prime time is really, really good, but it'll be fun. I've never used 91 Jimmy Graham. You also got Aaron Donald in this pack. So this pack was nuts. Also, I'm so excited to partner with eSwap on today's video. Let me show you something insane. The Thrustmaster eSwap X Pro Control. It's a beautiful controller as is. Get ready, yeet. Blue edition. Give me another 30 seconds, yeet. Green edition. This is a fully customizable competitive gaming control. So when your joystick breaks, you don't have to go buy a new controller. 
you just pop it out. The precision and durability on these controllers is absurd. The mini sticks and the buttons offer much better accuracy than what you're probably using. Like for example, my D-pad doesn't have to be here. I mean, shit, I could have two D-pads if I want. Doesn't make a lot of sense, but you get my point. It also has an incredibly strong wired connection. No latency, no disconnects. My personal favorite is the customization. You can do so many different combinations of really cool stuff with these controllers, and you don't have to buy a whole new controller every single time. There's also four additional buttons on the back right here for remapping, and a button bar on the bottom, which has volume controls and microphone muting. This controller has everything that you want. The Thrustmaster eSwap X Pro controller, available now at bestbuy.com, and as always, there'll be a link in the top of the description that'll take you right to it. Highly, highly recommend. Eswap again, thank you for sponsoring. And guys, enjoy the rest of the video. All right, then this is the bundle toppers. It's gonna be 483 pluses. We already got the Jimmy Graham though, so. I'm not too bothered if I don't clutch one out here, but Ed Reed would not make me upset. Ah, oh, well, okay, that's not what I meant. I meant the 90, okay. <laughs> Dude, I'm wasting no time. We're giving him X Factors right now. What does he get? Oh, he gets Ju- Dude, he gets Jukebox. Where is Enforcer? He doesn't get Enforcer. Yo, I'm so sad. I will give him a Lurker, though. Oh my god, this is so awesome. I'm gonna give him Lurker and Acrobat. I can't believe he doesn't get Enforcer. Dude, this card is so sick. I'm gonna be so sad when I have to reset this team. This team is so good. Literally all I wanted was an Ed Reed. And what do you know? We get an Ed Reed, baby. Jimmy Graham, Ed Reed, and I got one more. And this is only half the bundles. This is $50 worth of bundles right now. I get 100 per episode, 83. Free Ed Reed, that's fine. I get $100 to spend per episode. I'm gonna open one more of the exact same bundle. Anything I get here is bonus points, dude. And dude, with that Ed Reed, it's so lame that they don't have a different animation. Got two Halloween players there. 84 Bo Jackson and 83, oh, 82 Vernon Davis and presumably an 83 Champ Bailey. Oh my God. Pack and play that literally means absolutely nothing because I can't use two Ed Reeds. But in the context of my luck right now, what I'm literally gonna go buy a lottery ticket. I ask for one Ed Reed, I get two. Dear Lord, please give me a hot woman. We literally just can't stop. I get a big elite here, but just what's literally already. Oh my god, big, big Halloween player. What is it? I didn't even know that card existed. And I got 90 DJ Reed, and I need a D tackle too. Oh my God. I got Gronk and DeForest Buckner. That's actually not bad. Another big elite. At this point, I'm I, I'm 100% sure they increased back odds because this is like unnatural for sure. All right, and that leads us to just the toppers. The only thing that could help us here now is 93 Champ Bailey or 93 Finneran. So another 93 Ed Reed, although I would definitely freak out, would not be helpful. Our final pack of the episode, 83 Brian Finley. Respect. I'm a hit best lineup. Let me see what it does. I don't think my offense will change out all other than Jimmy Graham. Yep, so offense looks the same. It couldn't, yeah. Our AP is fully used with just Stafford and D-Hop. So I might look into changing that, but for now I am gonna keep it. Defense is where we gotta get creative because now we got 93 Ed Reed, Devin McCourty, Cromartie, Ramsey, and Murphy Bunting. Right now I have, I believe, Edge Threat on TJ Watt. DJ Raiders in, Aaron Donald is in, JJ Watt is in, we're up to an 88 overall. Yep, we're just gonna leave it like this. So Ed Reed, TJ Watt, Cromartie, and Murphy Bunting have my ability points on defense. And then just Stafford and D-Hop. So you're gonna see some insane new stuff today. You're gonna see Jimmy Graham. You're gonna see D-Hop. You're gonna see Todd Gurley. You're gonna see Ed Reed, Aaron Donald, JJ Watt. That's insane. Oh yeah, I'm only two and one. I forgot. I don't have many episodes in this. I'm not used to having a team this good this early in a season. Also, every touchdown we score, we get a pack. So he's got Julio, Diggs, Josh Allen. Can it topple Matt Stafford, Ed Reed, DeAndre Hopkins. Second and seven, another run play, Landon Collins. Damn, different play. Finally switches it up. Oh, we got to it. I'm clamping. I'm clamping. I'm clamping. No. Oh yeah, by the way guys, I don't know if I mentioned this already in a video, but for a little bit there I was recording in 4K and then um, it was just horrible. It was so hard to do and so not efficient. 
So I'm back to doing 1080p. I'm sure you guys won't notice a difference, but until technology catches up and makes this efficient, I'll be on 1080p. Wait, did he turn the ball over? Why do I not remember being on offense? Dude, am I okay? I think I'm having a stroke right now. Let's go. I don't remember getting the ball though. Why do I not remember getting the ball? Todd Gurley! I forgot that's his first rush. Let's go. Let's see if he finds a seam. Okay, A is cut. Oh, B! Oh my God, is he open? He is! What was that defense? You already know what we're about to run here. Michael Vick in for the fake. We just got this Michael Vick. That's the 83 Michael Vick we just got in a pack. We're gonna go McCordy, Wagner, and Ed Reed on this blitz. And then I'm gonna cover all with Lombardi! Oh, I didn't get him. This is probably a rage quit. I don't care if he's open, I'm throwing a D-hop. He's got red zone threat, so... Oh, shit, he's wide open. No, no, no. Wait, come on, throw it, throw it, throw it. Oh, Ed Reed with a sack right there. All right, Cromarty, Wagner, Ed Reed on the blitz, and I'll go Landon Collins to take the middle of the field. He's gonna throw a contested one. It's gotta be a rage quit. We put up literally so many points. All right, here's what I'm gonna do, because that was a quick one. I'm gonna hop directly into the next game, and any packs that I earn, I will do at the end of the episode. So right now, we got two packs. Here's I scored two touchdowns. Let's see what we get in this next game. My absolute favorite top three in the world right there. And he's got, ooh, I think we might have a game here. Dude, look at the hop Oh my God! <laughs> Oh my God, we caught him sleeping. This one's going to Michael Vick. Create a lane. Yes, sir, I'm in. Eight to zero. Wow, that started exactly like the other game, except this one only took me 11 seconds. Yep, I think we just got two rage quits, ladies and gentlemen. I guess we'll see though. Oh, maybe not, maybe not. He blocked an extra. We do have a corner route. We have, whoa. This is a slug out with 49 seconds played. Oh, wait a second. I wasn't paying attention and he did the exact same thing to me. Wait a second, why does it look like he's in the exact same defense? There's no way he lets this up again, dude. Dude, what are you doing? What am I playing? What is this? This man was a bona fide scrub. He can't play. Oh, dude, he's taking a good angle though. Damn, they caught me. I'm gonna step up with Stafford. Oof. I'm gonna take this field goal. That was a good uh, stop on the D hop there. All right, so he's blocking with the halfback. Oh, get there! I don't think Bobby Wagner's gonna be able to cover that corner route. Right in the middle. Oh my God. I think it. Oh, let's go! DJ Watt. Cannot get caught in a position where I let up something stupid deep here. Let's go! Oh my god, is he out of field goal range? I'm gonna be playing over the top. I know he's gonna try and do that same beater route. No! Yes, he's not there! He completed it, but he's not there! Let's see if we can find out here. Um, okay, a very, very wide open smoke screen, Robert Woods. So yeah. Wow, no, I hit the wrong button! Ah! I thought D-Hop was X! I thought D-Hop was X, oh my God. Holy shit, I was so confident he was X. There's not much open here. He could throw the playmaker, yup, he does. Yup, there it is, there it is. Oh, they're all there, let's go. Ah, uh, but this could be the fake again. Yup, yup, let's go! Just give me a little bit of time, gentlemen, yup. Easy throw to Gronk. Gonna get the hit stick here. Look at that. That's what it was last time, and that's the one that I missed. We're just gonna take this straight out of bounds. We just throw Robert Woods. Yep. Wow. It's so lame. I did not realize how much time was on the clock. I'm gonna throw underneath here, get out of bounds. Oh, girly! I should be able to hit Robert Woods. Oh no, I can't. I'm gonna throw this anyway. It can't really go poorly. Uh, this is similar, but not the same thing. TJ Watt is a freak. He's so good. They just gotta get to him quick. Oh, I got the corner out. No, I left that. No, I didn't, McCordy. Let's go, 85 McCordy. Run two slants and just figure out where he goes. I just gotta catch that now. That's a beautiful catch right there, my friend. Uh, does he go back to Robert Woods? He doesn't. Easy throw to make. Thank God I have fast receivers. I would be in a box right now if I didn't have fast receivers. Ah, uh, Tyreek cleared. Let's go. Oh, didn't get the first, but he got close. Third and two, I'm on it. What? A, no, why did he give me the flag? What's with that? Third and seven, this is pretty big. I definitely need Woods or Hop. Good blocking. We got to make something up, though. 
Stafford is not very fast. I got great accuracy. Wow, that's so stressful. That's so stressful. Barely made that kick. All right, I'm gonna be on Ed Reed for the corner route. There's the corner route. There's the corner route. Come on! You're so goddamn predictable. Oh! Ed Reed broke that tackle. Let's go! I don't know if that's the right call, but ooh, maybe it definitely is. Woo! Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Get the juke. Got it! Is that not a touchdown? Whatever, we got the first. We can chew a lot more fire. I really can kneel the ball. Three, two, one. Oh, we're gonna get the touchdown anyway. Going for the two point with this. So there should be a corner route out of that. I have the corner route. This is literally mad. Ah, I'm not on the right guy. I could get dotted up here. Oh, TJ Watts insane. This is Madden 20 defense. I just gotta cover the middle. I'm pretty sure this is pretty good against man coverage. Because we know he's on man. Nah. All right, so I got the corner route. Don't you dare. Ah, I was going to say don't you dare test Devin McCourty, but just got to chew this clock and this game's over. I mean, basically, what is the exact same thing? Does it matter? We hit Woods and the game is over. Let's go. Let's get it, boys. So that's five touchdowns. Lamar played better than Stafford. 10 for 17, 264, two touchdowns. I had two interceptions, Stafford. Granted, one of them was garbage time. So Todd Gurley, nine rushes, 18 yards. That's not that great. Three for 156. He had three for 137. Defensively, this goddamn freak. Five solo tackles, four sacks. Then his Aaron Donald had two. That was an awesome game. Hey, so we started this episode two and one. We are now four and one. And for my packs, I'm actually actually gonna do five elite packs because i want to switch it up i burnt through those the 50s i did so many i don't want to show you guys the same pack even though i think those might be like bang for your buck better than these we get troy reader we get another elite hey i got a punter pack three. Oh my god pack three is joe thune i needed a new left guard i got an 83 left guard in right now i now have an 86 that's huge not looking like we got much in this I kind of take it back. 86 Nick Chubb is a really solid pull. That is a new backup halfback. He'll go right behind Todd Gurley. We get John Hanna. That's a, literally another left guard. I don't need it at this point, but I will take it. We get Russell Okung. Yep, that's all five of my packs. New left guard, backup halfback, and I, I think that's technically a backup fullback. This team is insane. An 88 overall. My Wheel of Mud has never even been close to 88 overall. I love this team. I'm so excited for you guys to see the next back and play episode because I love this. Uh, TJ Watt, freak show. All right, boys. Hey, thank you so much as always for watching. This was an awesome episode. And uh, yeah, shit. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.